Hello. This is my final year project for Code in Place. We were all tasked to actually make a project about whatever our level, current level is uh, in Python. However, as I am a beginner, I chose to do this project, which we did about three to four weeks back. It is a simple project in which uh, we guess a number. If we do not guess it correctly, uh, it's too high. Either it's too high or it's too low. But if we guess it correctly, the whole program breaks and it prints the last line, uh, number 18. However, I added a twist and I added that every time that I guess it too high or too low, I perform a certain number of push-ups. So let me show you how this would run. I would run it in the terminal. First, I will enter my name. And then, as you can see, the print lines come. I will enter a guess. It's too small, so I'll go bigger. It's too high, meaning it's either 6 or 7. It was 6. So, uh, I did perform these push-ups, if you're wondering. And this was it. It's a simple program. It uses the random module, and then it uses the random radiant function. As you can see, uh, both integers 1 and 20 are placed in the place of A and B. It uses guess as an integer. Uh, it uses guess. Uh, the guess variable stores the integer value from the input as input always provides a string. So I had to change it into an uh, integer. Then we do a while loop. As we are uh, using to if and else statements uh, and maybe on our first try we cannot uh, hit the uh, elif statement, the, the number 14 statement, we would put another charge, we would give the user another chance to actually uh, guess the value. So this is used in order to keep the program running long enough to actually guess the exact value so that it may break. And then print the how many, how much push-ups we did and this is it. Thank you.